Okay, so we're gonna do our hair in our hair nets with the hair over the ears. Um, I do a bun instead of putting my hair in my helmet. I think it's safer. I know it's traditional to go in the helmet. So regardless of how you do that, I'm gonna show you how to do the ponytail. So we wanna make, pull our hair like we're a young lad in colonial times. So make a really low ponytail covering your ears. And then if you're gonna go in your helmet, you just put the ponytail, I'm doing a bun. So I make my little bunny bun here, secure it with a band tightly. And then I'm gonna get, I use a one knot hair net. So like these guys, I put the knot at the back. I go low on my forehead here, kind of down to my eyebrows. I go, so for me, I go down and around my bun and then I make a little loop like this and go back around it. I tuck everything in and then pull your hair net up to a comfortable place. I, since I'm very vain, go up right on the hairline. So when I take my hair net off, there's not a line there. There we go, over the ears, and then I kind of shimmy some more hair down. Again, we want to look a little bit like a lunch lady. Chris is probably going to walk in the tack room at any minute, wonder what I'm doing. Schooling at home, I take another hair tie and go around. If I'm at a show, I just make sure that my hair tie matches. So there we go. A little bit of a babushka, colonial boy, and also lunch lady. And then all you gotta do, pop your helmet on, shimmy it around, and then I just do one more little pull of my hair. The other key is you want to make sure that your hair color matches your hair net as closely as possible because you can't really tell what's hair and what's hair net there. Ta-da!